Hi my treats! Today I'm going to be playing a horror game called Evelyn and today I'm going to be playing the first part and then hopefully next week I'll be playing the second part. So it looks like we have to walk into this police station. Uh, that says part two, so part one. I'm gonna be playing by myself. My sister won't be joining me today. So here we are. It's loading. Warning, this game includes loud sound effects, mild strobe, lighting, and sensitive content. For the best experience, wear headphones, play in a dark setting. I'm wearing headphones, but I'm not in a dark setting. So, enjoy. Uh, let's watch the cutscene. Who are you? <laughs> Hello, detective. Glad you could make it here today. Glad you can make it here today. I'm Mr. Oaks. Last week, my daughter, Evelyn Oaks, mysteriously died. Why is his head going back and forth to the side? The hospital have not found out what caused her death yet. Is he trying to check me? <laughs> Here, take a look at the case notes. No, why does he keep doing that? Uh, Miss Evelyn Oaks, born April 14th, 1908. Died October 13th, 1921. So she was 13. Evelyn died on Friday, the October 13th, 1921. Her death, her death cause was unknown. I can't read. The local hospital have not found anything suspicious. I couldn't finish reading. Well, you guys can pause it and read it. Me and my wife have been living at our second home a few miles away since Evelyn died. Okay. We got Evelyn a doll for her 13th birthday that belonged to a royal family member. Okay. After we got Evelyn that doll, strange things have been happening in our home in our house it says house objects move doors slam and the lights flicker it sounds like you have a ghost in your house why are we at the police station call ghostbusters after evelyn died we could hear footsteps giggling and music playing by itself Listen, if those things are happening in your house, you need to call Ghostbusters. The police can't do anything. Personally, I think the doll has a connection to Evelyn's death. Dot, dot, dot. That is ridiculous. The doll has nothing to do with her death. Are you her mom? That's probably the mom. Sorry about that. I miss Oaks, Evelyn's mom. Mother. So she's the mom, and then the dad is the police. We moved out of the house the same day she passed, passed away. This, this type's too slow. I can't read in a nice steady flow. Everything in the house reminds me of her. It's too hard to live there now. So move. Detective, can you look for any clues or objects that will help us solve this case? Okay, so I'm the detective, and I have to figure out what happened to Evelyn. So, it looks like we just got dropped in this house. I have played this before, but it was a long time ago, so I don't really remember what to do. So, there's a long hallway. This house looks really dirty. Okay, uh, is that door unlocked? Oh, there you go. So, this looks like a kitchen. So we're missing a pie over here, or cake, whatever that is. Does the refrigerator open? Well, that a plate just crashed onto the floor for some reason. Okay, well, um, gonna see if this refrigerator opens. No, the oven. Oh, there we go. So there's Evelyn's pie. Put it there, and something else happened. The water just turned on now. Is there something in the sink? What am I supposed to do? Oh. 
a sink plug. So I put that in there. And what's in there? There's nothing in there? Oh. The key. So this... Anyway, so <laughs> let's go to the bathroom. Listen, she disappeared. That had nothing to do with me. Are we going to open the bathroom? What's going on here? Unlock. Is it going to unlock? What are we doing? That's probably not the bathroom, so I'm going to go look upstairs. There's a paper over here. June 25th, 1921. Today she told me to find something that used to be hers. I found it and brought it back to her. We have hidden this secret from everyone. It's fun having a big secret with my new friend. Now that we have hidden it, she's become stronger. Okay, so it sounds like Evelyn's ghost asked this girl to bring her something that used to be hers when she was alive. And I guess now that she has it, it makes her stronger or something. Okay, we're in the bathroom now. It looks like I have to find three toothbrushes. Um, okay, there was one in the towel, so there's one. So we have two more. Do these cabinets open? I'm clicking it, it's not open. Okay, there was one in the toilet. That's disgusting, I'm not using that. Um, there's one, is it in the tub? No. I feel like it's in the cabinet. In the trash can? I'm clicking it and it's not opening. Um, I feel like it's in the cabinet, but it won't open. Oh, there it is. I was clicking the wrong one. And that shelf just fell down. Okay, so now we have a main bedroom key. I think that's this room. Yep. Okay. This is a nice room. Um, so there's a safe it doesn't open and there's a box september 8th 1921 she told me if i ever removed the eyes then it would end everything even her i don't want that to happen you have to be careful not to do that i hope no one else will do it either i want to protect the secret forever okay well whoever this is clearly doesn't want to give up their secret um so that box looks like it's missing something and the safe is also missing something so i'm clicking the books to see if there's something in the shelf Um, <laughs> I wasn't expecting that. Well, here's an angel thing. Uh, it probably goes on this box. That actually scared me. I know you guys can't see me, but I jumped. Um, so this goes over here, the safe handle. Now we have a bedroom key. I'm going to look over here to see if there's anything else. That's a nice pearl necklace. Here's a picture. There's Mr. Oaks. Oh, the picture just fell. Is there something behind it? No. I think that's just for a scare tactic. Okay, the bedroom key over here. Let's open that. This must be Evelyn's room. This is nice. There's a doll over here. How fun. That's an ugly doll. Uh, remember, these look like a code to something. There might be a code we have to solve later, so let's keep that in mind. There's music playing. Uh, that dollhouse looks like it's missing something, so I'm gonna... Oh, there's the handle. Well, that was easy. Why is the doll standing up? Why are you standing up? And she disappeared. Um, paranormal activity. And there's another one. I'm still trying to figure out where that doll went. Okay, we're, um, <laughs> I think this key goes to that room downstairs that we couldn't open, so we're just gonna go back down there, see if it opens. Okay, I keep hearing footsteps. This must be the living room or the great room, something. Let's look around and look for clues or anything. Uh, there's a note in the dining room. October 13th, 1921. She lied to me. She's using me. She said she will live in my body forever after tonight. I need to stop her before she does this. I need to expose the secret that I have hidden for her. If I do not write again in my diary, she won. Hopefully someone will find it though. Now that I'm done reading that, I don't know if it's talking about Evelyn or the doll. 
but i feel like it, evelyn is the one writing and the doll is telling her to keep her secret or something so i think the doll wants to take over evelyn's body i think i'm not sure um but i'm clicking the books right now to see if something will open up or a clue will be revealed anything uh this picture that one oh it did fall what's this what did that do what oh, opened the clock okay so there's numbers nine zero three seven so that has something to do with the code we saw upstairs so there might be a code we have to enter somewhere um does the tv turn on it didn't do anything is there something inside the fireplace i don't see anything something up there I'm going to click these other books. Um, I don't see anything. Nothing's happening. Unless I'm not clicking the right thing. I'll rub against them. See if something happens. Uh, I'm going to look in the fireplace. There's nothing there. Okay. Um, I'm going to look around. Something in here? I don't think so. It's just a normal dining room. Um, and then the clock just has the numbers in it, so there's nothing over there. And I clicked up there already. Nothing's happening. Clicking the books. The fireplace. Nothing's happening. I feel like I'm doing something wrong and you guys are making fun of me. Um, is there something I'm supposed to be looking at? I don't understand what's happening. That button opened the clock. Um, I'm gonna go back upstairs and look at the code, the pictures. Let's see what things I need to click. And there's nothing else up here. Um, okay, so nine looks like that little flower. Zero is a star. Three is a cross, and then seven is that little diamond shape. So we just have to remember that, okay? And there's nothing else upstairs. We looked through everything, and we read all the notes, so there's nothing upstairs that we need besides that code. So whatever I need is in here. Um, hmm... Uh, <laughs> I don't know what to do. I'm gonna mess with this TV. Oh, would you look at that? Take a good look. Seat the black book. Okay, so clearly I was doing something wrong and we have to look for a black book. See, because I clicked it before and nothing happened. So, I don't see a black book over here. It might be on the other side. Is that a black book? No, that's gray. And it says the black book. Okay. Um, is that it? Did something happen? The fireplace opened up. Okay. And then this is where we put in our code. So it was 9037. Okay. Let's see if I got that right. So we have to put it in and then click the check mark. I did it! Um, there's the doll, that's where she went. Um, why did your eyes just turn red? That needs to be addressed. <laughs> what do I do now? I don't want to turn away from the doll because she might jump up and try to kill me. So I took her eyes and this opened up. It's a red stone. Okay, um, this all makes sense now. What happened? Queen Martha was the queen about a hundred years ago, but got executed days after becoming queen. Why did she get executed? Can you even do that to the queen? Apparently Martha was a witch, that explains it, even though she was part of the royal family. Imagine becoming queen and then getting killed days later. Luckily we have Martha's tiara gem back, back now. So that, that was her tiara gem. Without the gem on her tiara, her spirit was set free. So is Queen Martha inside the doll? 
I feel like she was. I knew the doll had a connection with all of this. With all of this. I swear this type's too slow. Martha's spirit must have been living inside of the doll. And now she wants to take over Evelyn and have her body. But now she has taken over my daughter. Yep. Thank you for your help, detective. And you're very welcome, Mr. Oaks. Hopefully the gym has stopped Martha from haunting the doll and our house. Yeah. Now Evelyn can rest in peace. Yay! Uh, why are the lights flickering? How strange. Evelyn was standing behind him. I don't think it stopped. She's still here. <laughs> you didn't scare me this time. Haha. -ha. And I was disconnected. You were kicked from the disappearance. You have completed part one. To be continued. Alright guys. Well that's the end of the video. I hope you guys enjoyed this. Don't forget to like and subscribe. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye.